Hi guys welcome back to my channel it's Larasia Andrea so in this video I'm going to be showing you guys two different versions of baby hairs that I've seen on Instagram and I've been doing so the first one is to me called the dramatic baby hair and to me this is really considered like the lazy day like if I'm rushing I need to be out the house I need to be out the door I have a lace that I kind of have to do a little bit more work with whether it's too dark for my skin complexion it's like that brown a gray type of um, lace that you guys know is so hard to blend in this is pretty much what I do so I'm taking some lace jelly from bolt hole this is their new product I used this in my last video and I definitely told you guys I'm going to try it out again um, on my last trip that I just had to Atlanta I was using this to lay down my baby hair and I love this because number one it doesn't have alcohol which is very good for not drying out your scalp and your hair line and number two for those that were like kind of allergic or got minor burns on their scalp from got to be this is going to be a very good alternative for you and also it does not lift up your lace so one problem I was having before is that my lace would always lift every single time I tried to go to do my baby hair I would melt down my lace everything would be fine and then once I put a product on my lace to try to do my swoops it will always lift up so with this product I feel like it's super good because it does not do that So I just went ahead and tied down a baby hair and as you guys can see it doesn't look completely bad you know what I'm saying because we've seen people with baby hair like this aka me y'all know it took me a while to do my baby hair correctly it took me <coughs> two years but that's okay so I'm just going ahead to do my hot comb and yeah that is pretty much it for the dramatic baby hair portion nothing to it it's easy peasy lemon squeezy you know what I'm saying um and then I just went ahead off camera and just wand curled the hair if you guys are curious about this hair I will definitely leave it down below but I'm actually thinking of doing another video with this hair um and also if you guys are curious about my jumpsuit is from Posh B I will leak that link that down below as well and my fave lip gloss is from Juvia's Place their clear lip gloss so now this is going to be a second way of how I like to do my baby hair recently and this is the natural baby hair so now you guys can see that the hairline is plucked a lot more it's looking a lot more natural um this type of way of doing baby hair is obviously going to be a lot more work this is not for someone that just needs to be out the door need to get out and go you know what I'm saying you just have to take your time a little bit more with this type of method so this time I'm showing you guys how I installed the lace with the bolt hold lace jelly you can use this gel for laying down your baby hair and also for doing your install so for this one I decided to just show you guys both methods one other thing I want to point out to you guys or actually two other things is when it comes to laying down your lace with this product you have to be mindful that they do not have alcohol in this product so it definitely dries a lot faster than like a got to be gel would or um, any other type of gel so just be mindful that it does dry a lot faster so only blow dry when you do for about two seconds or three seconds at most no more than that and also when it comes to blow drying make sure you guys aren't putting your fingers on the gel because you do not want it to turn white
So for this part, I'm just taking a little bit of the gel and just putting a little bit onto the lace and then I'm just blow drying a little bit. But as I'm blow drying, you guys will see me start to just comb the little hairs that I have in front out because you don't want those to dry down because these are going to be the things that I'm going to be using to lay down my baby hair. So I'm just taking a little bit of the Sebastian Shaper Spray. This is the reshaper. I love to use this when I do my meltdown. Um, I did notice like over my trip the past couple of days that I just pretty much have a whole regimen of how I like to do my laces now like I know how to do a meltdown I know how to do my baby hair now and when it comes to melting down your lace honey it is important hey okay it is important you have to melt your lace down before you lay your baby hair because if you don't you will experience lifting and not only that it's the product that you use and the lace jelly from bold hold definitely does not add to the lifting on the hairline. So I'm just taking my comb and just went ahead and just combed out the baby hair like you guys saw me do before. And I do take a little bit of the bold hold. It's actually the thing that you use in prep to doing your lace glue. It's the bold hold skin protectant. It's not alcohol and it's not water. I don't know what type of product it is, but I love to use it for taking away any shininess or any oily looking scalp that I would have on my hairline from when I laid it down with the lace jelly so that's just gonna uh, added pro and a tip to let you guys know about so for the natural baby hair I'm just cutting the baby hair a little bit shorter and because I did pluck the hairline a lot more you guys will start to see that the baby hair will start to look a lot more natural when it comes to doing the swoops for this I just try to space it out a little bit more than how I did with the dramatic baby hair and also you guys will see me just comb back the baby hair more into the hairline and because we did pluck a lot more it definitely looks a lot more natural so you guys will see that I'm only using a little bit of the lace jelly on my brush and I will literally take a little bit of the lace jelly on the brush I will literally swipe it on some paper towel and then that's all I'm going to use when I do my swoops and you guys will start to see that it just starts to form super good on my hairline like I have no lift issues my lace isn't lifting up um, as well as it's not having any cakey buildup on the lace because that's another problem I would always face before
So when I went ahead and just put my scarf on just to hold down my baby hair and blow dry one more time, this is the ending result. And you guys can see a huge difference from the dramatic baby hair compared to the natural baby hair. This is how I've been doing my baby hair recently. Um, this is how I've been rocking it in all my Instagram pictures and everything like that. I feel like it definitely looks the most natural on me. So people have different type of baby hair methods. I showed you guys the one method that I've seen a lot of people do and even I used to do my baby hair like that. But now I pretty much figured out how I like to have my baby hair on my hairline. Everyone's hairline is different. This is what I think looks most natural on me. So yeah, y'all know I'm not a baby hair person but I've been practicing and practicing and practicing off camera and I feel like I've finally been able to nail it for you guys to show you guys on camera so I'm just putting a little bit of makeup on the hairline I did not do like the method that I usually do when it comes to making my hairlines more natural so I was a little bit lazy for this video because I definitely did this video in two days um, but y'all know I like to give y'all a good amount of content like I really put in effort when I do my videos but when it came to this hairline I was like mm, da -da, I'm gonna just do a little makeup and call it a day so this is the ending result for the natural baby hair and I will definitely do a side by side of the dramatic baby hair compared to the natural baby hair and I definitely gave you guys a little bit of tea on a product to start using when doing your baby hair soup it doesn't have any built-up cakiness it does not let the lace and I definitely think you guys should try it out because it's bomb so I would definitely link everything down below just in case you guys are interested and I can't wait to see you guys in my next video and bye guys